Just for some background info, I am a 18 years old male currently living in NY, I am 6 feet 4 inches and buff. I've always been the center of ridicule and teasing from a young age due to my size. Just for some context I stopped growing in the 9th grade, 4 years ago. I was already done with puberty and had a full on beard and was adult like. I took advantage of this sometimes too much which lead me losing my virginity in the 9th grade to a girl who was in college. This story takes place when I was in the 10th grade. I was lonely after a breakup with my then 7 month girlfriend. I was looking for a one night stand. So I turned to Tinder. I set up a fake profile with my real picture and waited. There was this gorgeous girl whom I matched with. This girl was too good to be true which gave me the first red flag yet I went along with it anyway. We exchanged innocent messages and planned to meet at her place the next day at around 9 pm, I wasn't as excited as you would think because I had some doubts on this girl, because I didn't know if she was real. So, 9 pm rolls around and I get ready to go to her place. I mentally prepared myself if anything crazy was going to go down. Before I left I texted my dad saying I was going to a friend's house and left. I asked my good friend Isaac who was 6 years my senior to drive me since he had a car. He warned me to be cautious as I was. Long story short he drives me to her apartment and I ring the doorbell. I hear light footsteps behind the door, and high pitched voice saying be right there. That's when I texted my friend telling him everything is fine and that he should leave. Boy was I wrong. The door opens to the girl in the picture. I immediately felt excited which didn't last for long. On my Tinder account I wrote that I was 24 when really I was only 15. She not knowing this swiftly asked me if I wanted a drink. I said I didn't want anything which visibly made her facial expression turn from happy to pissed off. I realized that maybe I was going to be drugged and I was not about to take any chance so I asked to go to the bathroom. She then out of the blue said sure, happily. Again her weird response confirmed my theory in my head. I go to the bathroom and quickly text my friend to come back and pick me up. Then out of the corner of my eye I saw a figure dressed in all black standing in the shower, trying to hide behind the curtain. I figured he saw me looking him because not even two seconds later he lunged at me. I was scared shitless even though I was massively taller than this man. He tried pushing me to the floor yet to no avail, I overpowered him too vastly. I grabbed him by the shirt and looked him in the eye, he was around 5 feet 10 inches sort of buff, mid 30s, bald and looked to be of Russian decent. I pushed him on the floor and cursed him out because I also know Russian. He tells to me fuck myself which is when I punched in the face. There I was, a 15 years old retard in a bathroom with a knocked out man. I panicked, but I keep my cool and took out my phone and took many photos of the man. By then my friend texted me and told me he was outside of the building waiting for me. But also by then the girl opened the door to bathroom and started to scream. I pushed her with all of my power and sprinted the hell out of that apartment. When I got to my friend's car I frantically explained to him what happened. I only then I realized I could have been drugged or worse. I obviously took screenshots of her profile and messages between us. Even though I had all the proof in the world to lock those assholes up I didn't because I was that scared of my parents and lied to them. Moral of the story be very cautious when dating online. <laughs>